What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. And today Moonshiners has gone live. That is one of the new roles that you can kind of pursue in game. Also alongside this, the Outlaw Pass 2 has also gone live. I'm sure most of you know about Moonshiners by now. I made a video about this when it was first kind of announced. But it is a new role that you can take, kind of progressing from the trader skill. And you can make your own bootlegged black market liquor. Of course, you can buy your own shack, uh, your own kind of business to make this moonshine in. And of course, you can upgrade this throughout the progression to make a bar space uh, inside of this building, a band, a dance floor, and additional upgrades for your moonshine equipment. Also, along with this, you'll kind of have a few story missions to do. You can either do solo or with friends. And it is pretty neat to kind of expand your business and make your own bar, that kind of thing. It's going to be another way to make money within game, of course. Also, it says the Moonshiner features its own unique progression path that unlocks both apparel, accessories, equipment, upgrades to improve the business, new weapons like the flammable Moonshine Jug, and unique ornamental design for the sawed-off shotgun, new horse breeds, and more. So, they've added a good bit with this role, even though it's not its own separate role, per se. You know, it's kind of something that just kind of goes off of the trader role. But most people have all these roles ranked up now, so they're looking for something else to do. And this is definitely something new to kind of mess around with. Also, like I said, going live today is Outlaw Pass number two. This Outlaw Pass will last from today until March the 10th, 2020. There's 100 ranks again, just like the last Outlaw Pass. Of course, it's going to cost 40 gold bars. For that Outlaw Pass, you will make those 40 gold bars back from Tier 1 to Tier 100 if you want to buy the Premium Outlaw Pass. But there is also some things that are available for free within that. If you do not want to purchase it, it's going to be pretty much like last time. You're still going to gain things like new clothing items and accessories, uh, you know, masks for your horse, upgrades for your camp. So it is, if you play a lot, it is something worth looking at if you like some of the clothes design and things that they offer within the Outlaw Pass number two. Also, some things they changed today as well is the ability to quick swap weapons in the heat of battle, ability card rebalancing on certain cards, accessibility improvements, and increased stability for horses. So they did a lot of changes, or not a lot of changes, but some changes today along with this. Uh, but the big thing about today's kind of addition to the game, of course, is the Moonshiners and, of course, the new Outlaw Pass number two. Let me, let me know, guys, if you're looking forward to playing this. I know a lot of people out there still comment on a lot of my videos about having issues of still not being able to play. They still have connectivity problems. I know that is a big problem within the game. And that is one reason some people have stepped away. But leave me a comment. Let me know. Are you looking forward to playing this Moonshine kind of new role? And also, are you looking forward to that new Outlaw Pass? And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. If you have time, share the video. It does help out the channel a lot. Click the bell icon up in the top corner so you know when all my videos go live. And check out the affiliate here on the channel, GT Racing. They sell gaming chairs and office chairs. All their information is linked down in the description. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.